I don't know. I'd be a lot better off if I would have studied more when I was growing up, you know? But you know where it all went wrong was the day they started the spelling bee. Because up until that day, I was an idiot, but nobody else knew, you know? And the spelling bee day, you know, popped up. All right, kids, up against the wall. It's time for public humiliation. Spell a word wrong, sit down in front of your friends. You know, that's great for little egos. Hey, look at me, I'm a moron. I wasn't even close. I was using numbers and stuff. That's why I admired that kid who spelled it wrong on purpose so he could sit down, you know? He knew he wasn't going to win, so I stand there for three hours. First round, cat, K-A-T, I'm out of here. Then as he passed you, <laughs> I know there's two T's. I remember my teacher asked me, Brian, what's the I before E rule? I before E, always. What are you, an idiot, Brian? <laughs> Apparently. So she explains it, no, Brian, it's I before E, except after C, and when sounding like A is a neighbor in way, and on weekends and holidays and all throughout May, hey, and you'll always be wrong no matter what you say. That's a hard rule. That's a rough rule. Plurals were hard, too. Brian, how do you make a word a plural? You put an S. You put an S at the end of it. When? On weekends and holidays. No, Brian. No, let me show you. That's this kid who knew everything. Erwin. Erwin! Erwin, what is he plural for? Ox. Oxen. The farmer used his oxen. Brian, what? Brian, what's the plural for? Box. Boxing. I bought two boxing of donuts. No, Brian, no. Let's try another one. Erwin, what is he plural for? Goose. Geese. I saw a flock of geese. Brian, what? For moose. Dog Beats TV here. Um, I know I haven't made a 4th of July special. That's because I was busy on that day and then I had to go to um, out of town for the weekend. So I guess this is happy belated 4th of July. <laughs> also, the audio for this skit is from Brian Reagan. That isn't me. That doesn't sound like me anyway. So yeah. He has a, he's a comedian, he's pretty good, and that's why I watch him. So anyways, thank you guys for watching, I hope you have a great, wonderful rest of your Sunday.